In this video, we'll look at the number of protons, neutrons, electrons, and the mass number for Ba. That's barium. So for barium, there are a number of isotopes. These are the four major isotopes we're going to deal with. And the only thing that's different about these, number of neutrons here, and the mass number. But we'll talk about that a little bit later. First, let's look at the atomic number. So the atomic number for barium right here on the periodic table, that's 56. And that's the same for all isotopes of barium. If the atomic number is 56, it's going to be barium. And if we know the atomic number, we know the number of protons. So for all of these, that's 56 as well. When we look at electrons, let's skip neutrons for right now. Barium on the periodic table, all of the elements on the periodic table, they're neutral. But they don't have a negative or a positive sign written after them. They're neutral because the number of protons and electrons are the same. The positive and the negative are the same, they give you a neutral charge. So barium is going to have the same number of protons as electrons. Often when you're given this table, you'll be given neutrons or mass number. So let's figure this out for each isotope here. For barium-138, that 138 there, that tells us the mass number. So if we have a mass number of 138, the mass number equals the protons plus the neutrons. So 56 plus something gives us the 138. So we could just subtract 56 from 138, and we'd have 82 neutrons. Likewise, we could write these numbers in here for the mass number, and then just figure out 56, the protons plus something, gives us 137, and so on. I'll just write them in. When we look at barium, if we had a sample of barium, most of the atoms would be barium-138, about 71%. And then the other isotopes, there'd be certain amounts of those as well. The average of these isotopes here, that's what gives us the average atomic mass. So we can see that 137.33. So if I was given a table without neutrons or mass number or even this information, I would probably round the mass number to 137. Then I could figure out the number of neutrons pretty easily. This is Dr. B with the number of protons, neutrons, electrons, and the mass number for Ba, barium. Thanks for watching.